Attack the Gas Station is a 1999 Korean film. I might have actually seen this film before, but I haven't seen it in a really long time, so I wanted to watch it again. This one is about four delinquent youths who rob a gas station, and then they decide to get inspired to rob it again. So when they go for the second time, the, the owner uh, doesn't have the money, and uh, so they stick around and they take everyone hostage. So they, they kidnap the three employees there, and the owner, and uh, we don't really know what they want, but they're very violent and good at fighting, and they decide they're going to learn how to run the gas pump and then charge people to fill a tank even if they don't want it and keep the money. So they're, they're, they sort of start as a sort of, we're gonna use this to get money. However, it turns into a hilarious satire of, um, I guess, uh, manor culture, and uh, it feels like a counterculture film that you'd watch with uh, Jack Nicholson or Dennis, uh, Hopper. Uh, the film quickly starts escalating whenever they get a jerky customer and they just kidnap them and throw them into the room. Uh, or they'll get someone in the, the you know, they'll say they're kind of a jerk so they tell them to, to, to eat shit or whatever and then take the money. And then, you know, every time they have another person come by, you get a sort of microcosm of all these weird people that hang out or are connected to the employees or the owner. So for example, there's these two cops that uh, go for gas they never pay, so they end up being a trouble whenever they show up. There's also a, uh, a couple of bullies that bully one of the uh, employees, and they show up because he didn't go to them to give them money. So every time they add to their little pile of hostages, they end up having this whole room full of kidnapped people, uh, and um, they make them fight against each other. They sort of make them shift the balance of power to each other. Uh, one of them, one of the delinquents likes to make people sing. It's a really weird sort of film, but it's, uh, it, it's never too over the top. I really liked how they also have these really micro quick flashbacks. Each of the four delinquent characters had dreams and they were crushed by a ruthless, brutal society. One of them I think was in the military. One of them was a uh, aspiring baseball player. Another one was just a student, and then the fourth one was a uh, musician. That's why he likes to make people sing. So the four of them actually had their dreams and goals, but uh, they decided to fight back and start messing with society, and then it ends up in a huge brawl at the end. It's a really balanced film. Not 100% perfect, but uh, it's a really interesting sort of look at uh, society back in the day uh, and, and how it can affect uh, people make them delinquents or make people think they're delinquents before they have a chance. Uh, there's a lot of like young faces that are more recognizable now. They're obviously now superstars in Korea, like the, a lot of them. I'll just I'll probably post some of the photos on screen, but uh, Attack the Gas Station is a really well-rounded satire, mix of uh, comedy, black comedy, action, uh, satire. I give it an eight out of 10.